Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and today we are going to solve another marked price problem. So let's start. The problem says a dealer buys a cycle at Rs. 1250 and marks it at 40% above its cost price. If he allows a discount of 8%, find his profit percentage. So here, the shopkeeper He's buying, he knows everything and he is buying the cycle at rupees 1250. Now he needs to mark it. So in order to mark it, he increases it by 40%. So in order to increase something by 40%, now this is our original price which is rupees 1250 this can be called as 100 percent and we have to increase it by 40 percent so another 40 percent and that would be the marked price so one way to find out the marked price is to find out 40 percent of 1250 which will be equal to 40 over 100 into 1250 and we can cancel all these out and it would be equal to 500. Another way is that we can find out 10% of 1250 which is very easy you just divide it by 10 because 10% uh, is same as 1 10th of 1250 so that would be equal to 125 and now you multiply this by 4 so 40% of 125 will be uh, of 1250 will be 125 into 4 that would be equal to 500 so now we have to increase the price by rupees 500. So MP will be equal to rupees 1750. So this is the marked price. This is what the shopkeeper is going to show to the customer that this cycle costs rupees 1750. Now when the customer will come and he will ask for a discount the customer is asking for a discount the shopkeeper will give a discount of 8% on the marked price which is rupees 1750 again i can find out 1% of 1750 which will be equal to 17.5 so 8% of 1750 will be 17.5 into 8 which is equal to 140. So he gives a discount of rupees 140. So he sells it at rupees 1750 minus 140 and that would be equal to 1610. So this is the selling price. But still, if you look at the CP, it is rupees 1250. It is still more. So what does this tell us? This tells us that he is still making a profit. He bought it at 1250 and he is selling it at 1610. So how much profit is he making? He's making a profit. We have to subtract SP minus CP. So, how much is that? Yes, that is rupees 360. So, what will be the profit percentage? So, profit that is the increases of 360 over 1250 into 100. This can be cancelled and so this will be equal to 28.8%. 
so this is the profit percent which the shopkeeper is getting so i hope it is clear and you enjoyed watching the video goodbye